proud delegation, African woman, proud to be that. I'm also a computer scientist, a mathematician, I was an honor student, and I feel like now that the world is my classroom because I get to teach in it, I get to learn from it, and I really believe as the model of the organization I founded, the Gullah Geechee Sea Island Coalition, which is the first organization in the world that ever existed with Gullah Geechee in the name. Now, hold on, must take care of the roots for healing tree. And so it's so critical that I'm a person that every day feels everything I do should be something that gives someone tools to dig for something that would be that treasure that they can use to make the world a better place. I want the world to be a better place when I leave than it was when I came in. So that's really what we bring. What do you do to the Wow, so you have all night now. But this has a Yes. So as head of state from the Gullah Geechee Nation, as we say, head from the body, I have to negotiate with other heads of state of the world. And also, because we have dual citizenship in the Gullah Geechee Nation and the United States, I have to also deal with the states of North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, and Florida. I also have to deal with Washington, D.C. to make sure laws are not being created to displace us any further. And to make sure now a lot of my work pertains to a global action plan to try to combat climate change and sea level. And so on any given day, I have a mixture of things. I might be with children in the morning or just like here tonight. We will dig the terrace by the evening or the afternoon talking about how we can work together globally to keep cultural heritage alive in the face of all the other challenges we have. Mm -hmm. So what's the next for this relationship? With what's next for the relationship with Barbados? Well, it has been wonderful because Council Greenwich has escorted us all the way from Florida. He's been with us every step of this journey. And we've been talking about next year. We've been talking about not only the homecoming of Gullah Geechee, more Gullah Geechee's coming over so here. You next year is our Your 300. gathering. Yes, so you heard gathering. about the gathering, yes. right. Yes. And then we have the 350th celebration of the founding of Charlestown in South Carolina. So we're going to make this a two-way exchange where people should be coming back and forth and us building more on people learning about the history, heritage, and culture, and also helping to promote your World Heritage Site designation here in Barbados. We got to see it quickly today, but we got to see it and we're spending a lot of time right in that general vicinity. So this gives me more knowledge to take back to our people to share with them. And of course, your architecture, your colors, and the houses, the people here all look like what we're used to seeing at home. So it's easy. Of you all? See, I've been doing that to people all day. Now you did it to me. Right? And so it's a blessing because now we'll have an opportunity next year and then going forward for decades. We pray that. We're talking about the 300 and the 350th now that's coming in 2020. We pray that 300 years after 2020, someone sits and says, this all started because Queen Quet came back home to Barbados and we're still celebrating that journey and we're still celebrating our connection between these two nations. So that's really our goal, is to let the world know more about who we be and think like that. Are you going to another island? Oh, I have been to some, not on this one now, but I just was in Bermuda a couple of months ago. I was in Trinidad uh, the year before last. I have already been to several of the Virgin Islands. So the journey still continues, and Jamaica's mad because every time they're looking on my Facebook, they're like, you're next door again, and you're not over here. But I'm, I'm sorry, I can only get to one at a time. So I'm making my way slowly, but I'm going to get to Jamaica as well. And so there's a number of standing invitations. So I know there's going to be a journey to Curacao and some other things that's coming up as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, my final question, what has been the highlight of this season? Wow, I'm barely into it. I'm not here 24 hours. So I would say the highlight so far was walking out across the tarmac, coming into the doorway in customs and having the sign there ready that Barbados welcomes Queen Quet and the Gullah Geechee delegation and to have a personal escort to the front door of the airport where I dance with your dancers and your drummers. I think that has just taken the cake already. So we're going to see if they outdo themselves tonight. <laughs> yeah, at the museum. Yeah, at the museum. Yes. Oh, you're not coming? Oh, I 
just thought you were going to do this and then come on over and relax. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry you can't make it either. Well, I'm so glad we got to meet now. Yeah, so I have to get your card. And then we'll take a photo op together. Yes. Yeah, so we can stay in touch. Yeah. This is your photographer? Yes, this is one of them. You saw the other one that snuck up earlier. I'm gonna take it. Yes, so this is Kumar and this is Kwame. Okay. Yes, cool. so tell them on camera. How are you? Sir? So who exactly do you I, I work for? The Nation newspaper, which is our leading daily thing. Okay, Excellent. very good. Well, that is exactly what the Consul General told me when he came this morning. He said, Queen, excuse me, but we have a top reporter of our number one paper. Yes, he's like, he's like, this is our number one paper. They would like to talk to you. I said, of course. <laughs> you know, I knew he wouldn't just say something. So, yeah, he felt you know, the I papers. just got back from Jamaica two days ago. You're kidding. For Caribbean Fashion Week. Where I was going to ask you what were you there for. Okay. And for the first time in 20 year history, mm -hmm. they also showcased the work of three African designers. Did they? Yeah. Outstanding. So they're going to do a collaboration with that people where all the designers from the region are going to go, go over to other countries yes. there. Beautiful. Yes. You know what was wonderful? That so many of the Jamaican women who went to the fashion show mm -hmm. were already wearing African attire. Yeah. Absolutely. Design, you know? Absolutely. Yeah. So. We keep celebrating. Yeah. yeah, we have to keep celebrating. This is awesome. So let's get a photo together. Yes, please.